Happy Sunday, y'all. Today's swatches are going to be from SB Gel Polish. SB Gel Polish is a black woman-owned brand. These are handmade, HEMA-free gel polishes. I hope y'all can bear with me and forgive the clumsiness of this video. I am definitely not used to doing gel swatches, but I was so excited about this brand, I knew I had to show you. Um, the base and top coat that I'm using in this video are not the same brand, and they are not a brand that I recommend, so I'm not going to discuss them. I have since ordered a base and top coat from her, and I cannot wait for those to get here. Alright, so I went ahead and did all my base coats and put them in the light. All right, let's start checking out these colors. Now these first three are gonna be in the old format, which is in the bottle. She has actually switched over to jars for all of the colors. So when I get to that one, I'll go ahead and talk about that. This first color is called Iris Dreams and it is a very pretty light shimmery purple. This next one is called Big Sky and it is a light shimmery blue. Again, y'all, I'm sorry for how clumsy this is. I'm just not used to doing gel swatches on camera. Normally when I'm doing my gels, I'm painting it on myself and I'm heading out the door. I will get better at these swatches the more I order from this company. Okay, our last one in the bottle is called Mystique, and this is one I was so excited about. Y'all, this is a thermal, and when it's warm, it is a shimmery white, and when it's cold, it is a shimmery purple. I love this one. It is currently on my toes right now. All right, while Mystique sits under the light, I'm going in and doing a second coat of Big Sky and a second coat of Iris Dreams. And then I'm going to trade those out. I'm going to let those guys sit under the light and I'm going to do another coat of Mystique. Okay, these two are ready for a top coat and Mystique is ready to go back under the light. I was gonna top coat Mystique here, but then I noticed that I kind of made her a little bit uneven. So I went ahead and put a third coat just to even everything up and kind of correct my mistakes. Alright, those guys are done. There will be close up of those results in just a little bit. Let's get Mystique back under the light and move on to the beauty in the jar. 
Okay, this color is called pistachio and it is a light shimmery green. So as I stated before, all colors will now only be available in jar format. This was actually the first time I've ever used gels out of a jar. And honestly, I found it pretty easy. I felt like the consistency was nice. I felt like it was really easy to control how much of it is on your brush at a time and really easy to control where you're placing it. So all in all, I would rate the jar like a 10 out of 10 and I'm definitely excited to purchase some more and play with more of them. And the brush I'm using is just one that came from a set from Amazon. I can link that below if you're interested, if you're planning on ordering and you need some brushes to use. Y'all, I told you this video was clumsy. I have no idea why I'm sticking Mystique back in that light right now because she absolutely just needed a top coat. But whatever I want to do, I guess. Anyway, I'm on to the second coat of pistachio at this point. And I don't know if you can tell in the video, but like I said, it felt very easy to just glide right on and very easy to control where it was being placed. Also, as you can see right here, really no mess, no fuss. It was super easy to just wipe off the edges of that brush and set it down. Okay, so after being overcooked a little bit, Mystique is going to finally get a top coat and then we will cook her yet again and be done with her swatch. Honestly, this one was opaque enough after two coats, but I did decide to go ahead with the third coat. One, because I just wanted to play around some more with the gel in the jar. And number two, because I usually do three coats on my pedicures. So I wanted to make sure that the swatch stick was gonna be even and nice, the same way it would look on my toesies later. All right, just a few steps left. So I'm gonna go ahead and give you my little review. I love these. I have already placed another order. They are beautiful. They are easy to work with. They are HEMA free. So I find no reactions and no problems out of them, which is amazing for me because I have a serious sensitivity to a lot of gels. I am very excited to get in the base coat that I just ordered so that I can play with that as well. The owner of this shop is as sweet as she could possibly be. Absolutely 10 out of 10, absolutely would recommend. And she just launched a new summer collection and y'all, it is cute. Okay, I made sure to get a little time lapse of Mystique going from that white to that purple for you. And then I'll insert some pictures of the swatches as well. As usual, all the information will be in the description below. If you liked this video, please like and subscribe to this channel. If you want to follow me on Instagram, it is at creepybitty underscore nails, and I would love to have you. Look at that shift into purple. I cannot. I love it so much. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you had an excellent Sunday, and I hope you have an amazing week. Goodbye.